Mary! Mary, you forgot your winnings. I don't want to talk about it. I owe you a hundred quid. No, you don't. I mean, what were the odds of you winning that hand? 12.1%. Really? Yeah, I thought you had pocket tens and the big bed push you off, but I shouldn't have been playing. I, I just shouldn't have been playing. Yes, you should. You are clearly amazing at poker. Thanks, but it makes me a different person. I mean, you saw how it was with Simon. It's only Simon. It can't happen again. It must happen again. You have a gift. No, I don't. I have an addiction. Had an addiction. Awesome. Oh, dear. Mary! This is in the strictest confidence, OK? Of course. I lost a lot of money. And my MG. OK, my fiance's MG. And my fiance. Shit. But he was about to go to the Falklands, so he wasn't going to need a car anyway, and I would have won it back the next week. So it's... There'd been a breakdown in trust. I know that now. I'm the worst padre ever. Or the best. I'm going to phone my sponsor and make amends. God. But this is why I don't gamble anymore. Marry me. I mean, marry me and you should do more on this. I'll see you at breakfast. You bet. Her name was Jenny Driscoll. And she had something about her. She wasn't a star, and she never would be. But I was always delighted to see her. Ah, uh, have you had it all recently? Just before I come in. Goodness me, nurse. Yes, Dr. Whittle. And I would seek her out from her debut in Thumbs Up Matron. Oh, no, and about to look at his particulars. Until the end. Mr. Biggin was just saying he hasn't been feeling himself recently. Yeah, you said that was our little secret. I think you need a painkiller. Nurse, can you give him one? Oh, yes, I'll give him one right away. Through a colourful career best described as varied. OK. I need to deliver the bouquets to the town hall, but for some reason, the keys to the van aren't on the hook around the back where the keys go. Oh, yeah? What? The keys aren't kept on the hook. What? The keys are kept in the drawer. You know that they're kept in the drawer. No, I... So why are you here, Lucy? You can't just walk away. You need to give notice. So you want me back, then? No! No, I want you to act professionally and fulfil the terms of your contract. My contract? Yes. <sighs> OK.